Hey guys, it's Vince with Article Marketing Robot here. In this video, I wanted to show you proxies. A lot of people have been wanting proxies, and for the longest time, proxies were not required. Um, but some sites, uh, specifically article friendly sites, have integrated a type of stop forum spam, um, you know, service into their site. And you know, there's not very many of them that actually utilize it, but since you know people feel safe submitting behind proxies, I guess I'd integrate it. So, how to use proxies? Basically, it's in your tools menu. You have proxies right there, and then you have basically this window that will pop up. So, I have a list of proxies sitting on my desktop, and I'm gonna just load from file. This is just a basic, basically a standard text file, right? If I click open and there you go so I'll just show you what the text file actually looks like here looks just like this standard text file IP address with port and that's proxies I get my proxies through proxy goblin you can uh, access proxy goblin through this link here get proxies as you'll see once I drag my browser over that here's the proxy goblin uh, WSO and Warrior Forum. This is where you get Proxy Goblin from. And it's cheap, right? It's so cheap. 31 bucks. Wow. Big deal. And that gives you, you know, constant amounts of proxies and people just love this software. It just basically goes out and scrapes, uh, you know, proxy site lists, tests the proxies, and then places a file on your desktop and it does it all automatically day in and day out. So it's really cool that way. Um, so I've got Proxy Goblin running. I haven't had it running for a few days. So I don't know how recent this list is and how good it is. But um, what you can do is you can you can go in and test any particular proxy that you want against a judge URL. I use IP Chicken because I'm actually trying to find out if my, my IP address is showing versus somebody else. And you got a timeout here. So, I mean, if, if the proxy times out in like 2 seconds or 10 seconds, then that'll tell you that the proxy is quite slow. Now, um, this is only for testing. You, the real timeouts um, that are applied in tools options, you have a timeout there, is what will be applied against your proxy as well. So if you're using proxies, you probably want to bump up your, your uh, timeout setting in your tools options. So if I test a proxy, um, if it's good, chances are it'll head over to IP Chicken and it will show something like this. Otherwise, it might show a different IP address that isn't your IP address. I don't, I'm not an expert on proxies, but I, I'm assuming that it's still hiding your IP. But anyways, if this is what you see, then that is what you get. Um, so when your site list is, uh, when your proxy list is loaded, you can either you know add a, a, a proxy by single, or you can uh, control click and, and delete some proxies if you want, and whatever. So that's that's all that stuff. Use proxies is checked. If you have used proxies checked, then you will be using proxies. Once you click OK out of that, you're set up for proxies and you can start your uh, anonymous signups and posting and whatnot. And that's proxies. I hope that video was helpful. Uh, take care.